Hello and welcome back to the channel and welcome to another video on Farming Simulator 2019. I'm Texas Gamer. We're on a field called Old Country Life. We just got through harvesting field 42 and we have a cedar, a direct drill, planting coffee beans on 42. And let me get over here where I can get up in here and start harvesting these fields here, fields one and two. And uh, I'll show you something unique uh, that I added to my equipment. And it's on uh, field 43. So we'll switch over here to field 43. And there it is. We have a drone putting fertilizer on field 43. Uh, it's a pretty cool little device. We're going to stop it right there and see if we can lower it down. And rehire. So it, it should hug the ground and stay about that far off the ground all the way. Now we have uh, we have coffee beans uh, growing on uh, field 43. Got to start the engine up here. Then we have uh, coffee beans being seeded on field 42. Now what we have here. Let me see if I can get the harvester to open up. And we are uh, fixing to harvest soybeans off of field 1, 2. And I believe we have soybeans on field 24, 25, and 29. Now I need to get them in so I can uh, uh, get these fields reseeded. And what I'm attempting to do is all of my fields are going to have one seed type on all of them. Now I've got uh, coffee beans on uh, 42 and 43. And after I get them seeded with uh, coffee beans, then I'm going to move to field 1, 2, 24, and 29. And uh, I'm going to grow a crop of coffee beans, harvest them, and then I'll move on to the next. Uh, I haven't really decided whether uh, I'm going to do hops or uh, alfalfa or uh, clover. haven't really decided yet, but uh, I'm going to try to do every different type of seed that I can plant and uh, I'm going to keep track of the market right now soybeans not too bad uh, at the farmers market not too bad at all uh, right now we're doing coffee beans let me switch over here to coffee okay coffee uh, it's you know it's a grain mill it's you know thirty two hundred and ninety dollars for a hundred liters so that's really not bad either I have coffee beans right now and I think uh, I have quite a bit in uh, tobacco that I have harvested I believe off of two fields 43 and 42 I'm going to uh, go over here and look uh, over here where I can go look and we're going to see how much I have in tobacco. Okay, I have quite a bit in red cabbage. Now, I don't see Okay, it must have been hops that I uh, that I put in 
because my tobacco is not showing up, I'm going to run over here to the field and make sure what I... It was hops is what I harvested. So... I'm going to have to have a talk with my hands. They need to be telling me what they're actually harvesting. Uh, that tells me they wasn't paying attention. They were just guessing on what we were harvesting. I need to make sure they understand that they have to tell me what they're harvesting and they have to do it correctly because it can cause an issue when I believe I'm harvesting tobacco so I gear up to sell my tobacco, and then when I go to pull it out of the silo, there's no tobacco. So I, I need to make sure what I'm harvesting. But I can tell you I'm harvesting soybeans right now. That I can tell you for sure I'm harvesting. <coughs> this is field 42. And it's a, as you can tell, it's a little bit hilly. So this New Holland quad track runs a little bit slow uphill. I believe, let me check and see what the uh, direct, di direct drill is, uh, what the width is on that direct drill. Uh, it is an 18 meter direct drill so it's a pretty good sized direct drill and it requires uh, a 450 horse tractor excuse me I had to yawn requires a, a 450 horse tractor to pull it and it's a uh, 620 horse New Holland Smart Track 2. That would be the T9 700. <coughs> Excuse me. So, for it to be running slow, you know, it has to be uh, really hilly. And we're in kind of a soft dirt. So that slows down the uh, uh, tractor as well. And we're not anywhere near finished with uh, fertilizing field 43. Still got a long way to go. And I had a drone company call me and ask me to demo uh, this drone, Rubicon 9000. I'm sure I butchered the name, but uh, it's made. Uh, it's a lizard drone. So they asked me to demo it out in the field. Uh, so that's what I'm doing, and then I'll be giving them, them my honest opinion. But right now it looks like it's running pretty slow. Okay, I just hit the speed up button, and it's running max, which is 32. And it may do the field a lot faster. We'll have to see. And see how much ground we can cover and see if it's going to be worthwhile. It's a pretty costly, uh, costly piece of equipment. I mean, it's thirteen thousand, and if it's worth my while, I might buy a couple of them so I can get them uh, instead of having to get hands to drive around the fields with tractors. I'll just get. Uh, get the drones set up and it'll always be in their memory and they can take care of they can take care of all my fertilizer so we'll see what happens 
now where was what's going on here I don't know what happened here why would you cut off okay so let's see what happens I can't figure out why he would cut off I don't know but he did so we'll finish up this field shortly and then we'll move him to the next field tractor is putting down coffee beans and I'm gonna have to have my mechanic look at the direct drill because the seed tender is just it's not dropping any fertilizer that's why I'm going using the drone is to uh, fertilize my fields I may have to break out one of the big tractors with the fertilizer and I got one company from uh, uh, John Deere that's wanting to <coughs> excuse me John Deere's wanting me to demo one of their self-propelled sprayers and I got a couple of other companies just wanting me to do the same thing so uh, I may try one of them self-propelled sprayers out uh, I got a way to odds and see what I can come up with I'm running faster than a tractor okay back in the tractor so that's what's going on on my farm today we had a storm come through last night and I guess the wind just blew my old cedar over let's see what do we got in this tractor <coughs> okay we have fertilizer in this tractor So I think I'm going to go ahead and take this tractor. And I'm going to go ahead where I'm putting coffee beans in the ground. I'm going to go ahead and have this tractor fertilize the field. So I'm not going to have him speed up. I'm going to have him driving normal. So he'll run about uh, 16 mile an hour. He's almost finished. Let me get over here where you can see it. As soon as he gets up here, we'll set up and drop the head. Hook onto it and pull it to the next field. okay so okay we're gonna do that lower it down disconnect now we get up above it so we can see where the draw string is or the draw bar whoop okay and we're going to take it down the road and see if we can find another field. Oh, I'm sure we can find other fields. Whoops. I don't know what I hooked back there. We're going to go over here to field 24. And see what we can see now I have uh, the traffic turned off on uh, on my map because I just don't want to deal with traffic okay so now we're gonna 
come over here and we're gonna hook up okay fold everything up outside view and we're going to start him and there we go now he's off and running okay soybean soybeans look really really good I'm hoping to get a pretty decent yield off of field 24 and 25 so the spreader's moving the combine is moving harvesting soybeans my New Holland quad track is planting coffee beans and then I have my uh, drone fertilizer spreader spreading fertilizer okay so looks like everything is running fine I'll go out here and get my uh, little John Deere four-wheeler here and probably gonna go eat me some uh, breakfast I've been going since 530 this morning and I just had coffee so now I think I'm gonna go eat me some breakfast That is going to conclude our video for today. Until next time, this is Texas Gamer. We'll see you later.